This time I'm gonna go fully random and pick a prompt. All right. Okay. Okay. All right. My prompt is mainstream or niche. Okay. Okay. Shit. Oh God, it's Joey. Oh, okay, it's Joey. Like Citizen Kane. It's oh, that's that's it's so mainstream, that's dude. Fucking mainstream. My nouveau art <laughs> cinema. Think. We always talk about it. Let me think. Let me think. When we smoke the weed. <laughs> <laughs> when we smoke the ganja. <laughs> okay, I got it. Okay. okay. Tokyo Godfathers. <laughs> what? <laughs> and, and what would mainstream versus niche? Mainstream versus niche. I mean, oh. okay. Look, here's the thing. I think in terms of anime as a whole, it's niche, but as anime films, it's not niche. Have you seen it? No. What the fuck? Because <laughs> <laughs> I, I vehemently don't like anime films. And I am you not- You don't like anime films? You don't like anime films? No, I hate watching them. I don't know. Something about Why the what? fuck? Why? Something about the length <laughs> pisses me off. What and, the fuck are you yet, talking about? And yet, wait, bro, wait, wait, wait. and yet bro will sit down and watch an hour and a half long speed run you, video. You go to the fucking cinema yeah, you go to the every cinemas. single week. Out of the do. three of us, you go to the cinema. And I got to say, except for the, the boy and the heron, I've not had fun watching anime movies in the cinema. That's just, wild. Like I watched the Jujutsu Kaisen movie. It was yeah, that's because it was it's the a Jujutsu. fine movie. It's a fine movie. You God. have not watched it's good anime movies movie. in the cinema, Connor. You have watched fucking, you know, probably, you know, just shonen offshoot movies. Which I watched I the think odd taxi like, movie. Yeah. Hmm? I watched the odd taxi that's, movie. That's a condensed version of the fucking series, <laughs> motherfucker. <laughs> watch, watch a fucking film that was I just made watch for the film original. I, I have watched anime movies in the past that I just, I just, I don't know, I just found them so fucking boring. Am I crazy? Am well, I yes, crazy? You are, yes, like you are what? crazy. Uh, what's an anime film that you found I, boring? I watched. What's the uh, girl left through time? I watched like the first hour. And I couldn't even. Get okay, but it. that I I could already tell that you wouldn't like that movie. <laughs> I was like, turn this shit off. I don't know. I just can't. Did man. you watch Your Name? No. You watch Redline? Uh, I, I have not watched Redline. I had it on That's Blu-ray. Wild. I had it, I had it <laughs> That's wild. I had it on Blu-ray and hadn't watched it. That's crazy. <laughs> I don't know. I've just like, you know, I and mean, well, I'm happy that no matter what you guys say or what I think. You already gave the hotter opinion, so I'm. Sick. I just I, I can't. Believe I know I'm this. not alone in this. I know that I'm not. A, I'm. There are a lot of anime fans out there. Unite with me that we do not watch anime movies. Fuck anime movies. Yeah, if, if the I only don't anime, want anime movies. if the only anime movies you watch are it's Jujutsu the Kaisen Zero. <laughs> <laughs> that was a fine movie. Yeah, it was a fine. It was a fine movie. It's it's. Yeah. It's but not. Like, a, I, it was you know. very commercially successful, but as a like as a movie, I thought it was fine. It's another shonen movie. Did you watch the Demon Slayer movie? Uh, I watched it as a TV show. Oh, that was also that was also just fine. That was good. Yeah. Good. It was. It was. You know. But like, I, I, I like anime because I can get my 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 claws in it. I can get like sucked in, and it's a long experience. I like that right. anime. And I think when you make the runtime essentially five episodes, four episodes, I feel like it just loses a lot of the charm. That's my personal opinion. Well, I you know, that, you I know, think, I, th I think you're coming into this with the wrong. Sorry, we're, we're going to get back to this in a second. Uh, I think you're coming into this with the wrong mentality because yeah. anime films. Are just films. The, yeah, the, the good ones are do you, just. Do you feel that films. way about like regular films? No, You're just yeah, like, weird, oh, I right? wish I, I wish <laughs> no, this was a TV series. <laughs> I mean, there are some movies where I'm like, this should have been a TV show or vice versa. Like, yeah, some yeah, TV of course, show. yeah. But like, I, I don't know why. But with anime movies specifically, I, I generally just don't like them. I, but I, I really like Boy and the Heron. That was fun. Right. Yeah. And, well, that's uh, uh, you know that's more traditional. I, I don't know how to say it. Like, I guess. Ghibli films feel like films, but then sometimes yes. you watch other anime movies, you're like, nah, it doesn't feel like an anime movie. Well, yeah, yeah. like Juice the Kaisen yeah, like Zero. Yeah, like Juice the Kaisen Zero. Of course, but yeah. like, I don't know. I, even when I was watching, I guess, cause I, I haven't watched that many, but the yeah. ones I have watched. I think you just yeah. need to watch more anime films. Yeah. I well, just, in I terms just, of- They're always the same. Like, I feel like there's never, at least like a lot of the, when I started watching anime, a lot of the, everyone's like, you gotta watch these 10 anime movies. They're the goats of anime mm. films. And it'll just be like, sad girl who has to do thing or sad boy who has to do thing. And he's a teenage boy. And okay, he, question. And I'm like, Ugh. have you watched a single Satoshi Kon movie? Uh, is he the one? Who did Bell. Tokyo Ghost Files? Is it Bell? That's no, not that's Satoshi Kon. Oh, that's that's Mamoru Soda. Oh, right. yeah. Who's the, those two though? It's those two are the main guys, right? It's, yeah, it's Mamoru like Soda. Satoshi Kon, Mamoru Soda, Shinkai. Yeah, those two yeah. like, well, and I've watched uh, uh, Perfect. Perfect, Perfect Blue? Blue. Blue. I like that one to be fair. Yeah, yeah that, well, that, that still felt like a TV show to me. What? Yeah, I don't know why. Ooh. Oh, I watched Ghost, Ghost in the Shell movie I watched as well. Right. And the whole time I was watching it, I was like, I mean, I'm not gonna lie. I watched it, I watched it with Ludwig again, like maybe three months ago. Yeah. And I remembered it being way more 
good. Because <laughs> when I rewatched it, I was like, oh, that's it? I mean, it's no standalone complex, but- Yeah, that's why I feel like, I yeah. feel, once you've watched standalone complex, you're like, damn, the, the original's kind of ass. I mean, I wouldn't yeah. say it's ass, I mean, but it's, it's, I it's mean, like, I would definitely prefer to watch standalone complex, like, but it's still a good movie. The movie, the movie is kind of just like, it's, it's kind of just over. Yeah. And I feel like there's not a whole lot that, I mean, I, I guess I get the point, but yeah. Yeah, I, to, to me, anime movies- I'm also um, not a very good critic, by the way. So if you're, if you're on my side here, you should be ashamed. <laughs> <laughs> so like, to me, anime movies in terms of like, in terms of like good anime movies, mm. they are a lot rarer to find yeah. Yeah. than good anime series. Yeah. Um, mostly because there are way more anime series that are being made. But some of my favorite anime of all time are a lot yeah. of the times anime, like some of the best anime movies because yeah. you, you know, like Ghibli films, like Satoshi Kon films, a lot of Mamoru Hosoda films, they, it's not just like a shonen offshoot. It's not one piece film five, film 10. It's not a Demon Slayer movie that is basically a TV series condensed into a film format. Mm. It is a, it is just a normal film. Yeah. It's a complete package. I, I just, yeah, I, I think I, I tried to watch, I watched Bell. That was the last proper like anime movie I guess I watched. Yeah. I don't really consider Ghib Ghibli films in the same kind of thing. Cause they, yeah. they feel so standalone. Yeah. Um, I think Bell and, was and that, that made me one of his weaker like, movies, unfortunately. Yeah. I didn't as well. even watch it. That, that, <laughs> yeah. made me, that made me be like, nah, not giving these a shot anymore. <laughs> I was like, nah, I'm not doing this. Well, you should watch Tokyo Godfathers, which by the way, going back on topic, is a niche or mainstream. Topic. Is Tokyo Godfathers niche? I think Joey put it. No, it's it's way more niche. As as, as no, a, it's not. Is it? Yes, it is. I I, I think it's niche. Um, what? Okay, really? if if uh, I've heard of it, <laughs> that's because you hang out with us. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like yeah. let's let's say I, I knew about it before I hang out with you guys. From where? Because uh, it's always like listed on like the top like ten best anime films. Right. Anime Christmas film you have to watch. Right. <laughs> You're like what? I, I would imagine like if a normal person, I'm, I'm, let's let's say normal person mm -hmm. knows a little bit about anime, right? But no, most- No, yeah, it's not Yeah, they, they, are, they are not gonna know it mm. at all. Hi. Um, Even a lot of new anime fans do not know much about but, Satoshi Kon movies. I'd say most anime fans fall into like here. What do you mean? Well, maybe I guess like here. Like yeah. They wouldn't know any of this stuff. Yeah, so it's not super, okay. it's not, it's I, not like I, that super, okay. super niche. Where are you gonna put it? But I think, Niche is the right side, by the way. Oh shit. Yeah. Oh shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Everything. okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I was about to back. fucking say, I was reverse, like- reverse. Reverse. Okay, okay, okay. All right. That's weird that it's- hmm. Okay, so I would put it right yeah. at, right dead center there. Okay. Like there are more niche anime okay. films out there, but uh, in terms of like anime as a whole, mm. um, it's not, it's obviously not mainstream. Yeah. It's not like in the <laughs> middle of like niche and mainstream. Cause mm. I would say, a mm. lot of anime, fa you know, this is the kind of movie you watch if you really, really mm. fucking love anime, mm. okay. right? All right, so, so I'm, uh, I, I, I said here, you said here. Yeah, all right, let's see where Joey put it. <gasps> oh, you were spot on. My man, my man, my man. My man. My man. I, I experienced shit. this firsthand because uh, last week they were doing limited reruns of Satoshi Kon films in the cinemas. Oh wow, nice. To like celebrate his like life or whatever. Mm -hmm. And they, and I watched uh, a double screening of Paprika and Tokyo Godfathers. Yeah. Oh, like he, made, on, he made uh, Tokyo Godfathers? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. Um, and it was crazy. Like Paprika, full cinema. Mm -hmm. Tokyo Godfathers, me, my uh, Masa, <laughs> uh, you know, the guy who works at Geek's Boss and yeah. like four other people. Yeah. Like <laughs> no one was there for Tokyo Godfathers. <laughs> I was like, damn. I mean, like, I know it's like one of his lesser known works. Cause like when you think Satoshi Kon, it's like, oh, Paprika, Perfect Blue. Right, right. It's like, no one thinks of like Millennium Actress or Tokyo Godfathers, right? Even though it's such a good movie. Yeah. I mean, I think Tokyo Godfathers is actually his least talked about movie. Yeah. I would say. Um, I would say in terms of like popularity, I'd put Perfect Blue at the top. Paprika. Then Paprika, Millennium, Millennium Actress, Actress, Tokyo yeah. Godfathers. Yeah. I and forgot how funny that movie was. Yeah, it's really good. It's really funny. But I would say out of all the movies he's made, Tokyo Godfathers definitely feels like his most diff his most different movie. Yeah. Uh, Cause it, I'd say it's- More whimsical. I, it, I, funnily enough, even though it's his least well-known, in my opinion, I think 
in terms of like structure, it's probably the most normal. Yeah. You know? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> it's, definitely. His, it's definitely his most normal meal. Uh, yeah, because movie. we watched Tokyo Godfathers first. And yeah. I was like, oh yeah, this was fun. This was whimsical. This is cute. You know, I forgot how funny it was. And then mm, I watched yeah. Paprika and I was like, wow, oh I feel like I've taken drugs now. <laughs> like, oh I guess it's I so watch, much I more watch. wild. Yeah. yeah, But it was great. I, 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 did, I did like Perfect Blue. I should, I should give uh, more films a shot. You should. You should watch Satoshi Kon films, man. Okay. They're great. Yeah, I should, I should. Is it yeah, Christmas? Right. It's a great Christmas uh, movie. All right. <laughs> all right, so I um, I got the next prompt. It's easy to sit on, hard to sit on. <laughs> okay. <laughs> easy to sit on is this side. Okay. It's okay. hard to sit on this side. Okay. Easy to sit on left uh, side. My prompt is the chair in the department store. What the fuck does that mean? Which one? That's it. The chair in the department store? I, I don't have a frame of reference. That could be to... any chair. What, what, what kind of chair do you see in a department Not store? Not a bench, right? A chair. Could be a any any sitting thing in the department store. I'm trying to think. <laughs> I'm, tr I'm I'm actually like drawing a blank, like trying to remember any time I go into a- Every department store I go into has a different type of seating. Mm. So in that case, it would be fucking right in the middle because sometimes it's super easy to sit on super, way too comfortable for a department store quality. And then sometimes it's like, a single fucking metal pipe where you're like, how am I supposed to balance my ass on this thing? Well, that's not a chair, is it, Joey? Yeah, but it's hard to sit on. But Joey, he said a department store chair. Yeah, but you've seen some of those chairs where it's like, who came up with this design? This is not comfortable. I, I, it's more comfortable to fucking just stay standing. And then there are some where it's like triple cushioned, like it's like, oh, I could fall asleep on this thing. I don't think I've ever actually sat on a chair in a department store that's been fucking triple cushioned. Oh, I have. <laughs> what fucking department stores have you been going uh, to, Joe? There's a couple of department stores I've been to where it's like, God damn, like I, I want this in my house. <laughs> it's nice. I And then um, there are some where it's just like a plastic fucking, like, it's like those plastic kindergarten chairs. And it's like, I this feels like it's about to break under my weight. So I'm putting it right in the middle because there's just too much variance. I'm gonna put it more towards the hard to sit on because I'm, I'm okay. Maybe 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 around like slightly hard slightly to slightly hard to sit on. Okay. Uh, here's my here's my reasoning why department store chairs are slightly hard to sit on. Uh, I don't. I can barely remember the last time I sat on a department store chair because I think most of the time I would just rather stand up a lot of the times. Right. Um. And you, I only really sit down if I'm like really really fucking desperate. To sit down. Right, you've you know. been like walking all yeah, day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You've been walking thing, all right. day kind of thing. So I'm gonna put it slightly harder to sit on, though this is a really hard prompt because I don't even know what a department I, store chair I looks have, like. I have no clue. So I have no like. clue. So Joey's going right down the middle. Right going, down the middle. I'm going slightly harder to sit on and right. Connor has put it. <laughs> what? Dude, you- The were, most you, easy to you sit were on? You were so close. What? You were so close. You were saying, you only sit on it when you're so desperate. Yeah. It's yeah. literally, there is no chair that is better. Picture it, you've been, you know, maybe Aki's dragging you around the stores all sure. day. Sure. You're like, she's like, just one more store. Yeah. And in the corner of your eye in the store, they have a three seater bench or chair. And the moment you can, you can perch your cheeks on it. It's like a, a, a chair sent from heaven. It, Cause it, it's not a chair that is most comfortable, but it's there at the most desperate of times when you need it. Yeah, no, but see, no, I've been to some department stores okay. where I felt that way, right? Where I'm like, uh, I've been, it could be I've the been worst walking. chair in the world. If it's in a department store and I, I've been standing nah, for- I'm, I'm, I'm gonna make chair. an argument. Cause there ain't no way if it's a, it's a, if it's a comfortable chair, that chair's going to be free. Yeah, Those exactly. chairs are never <laughs> it's fucking hard to free. On. But like, it's, like, it's from a sitting perspective, <laughs> your butt on that chair. <laughs> No, it's no. the best. There no, is no it's hard to sit better. on because it's not of, open. Because it's not easy to sit on, Connor. Because nah. I can never fucking sit on also, it. Connor. There are, also, there are some department store chairs. Nah, where my aura, they move. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> you say it, it's hard to sit on. What? <laughs> It is, it is there it's objectively some, the best. It's like an oasis in the desert. Nah, there are some department store chairs. All day. I, I could have been like, I could have done like 30,000 steps, right? And my legs are dying and I'll see a department store chair where it's like, I would sit on it immediately. The most uncomfortable shit in the world. No, I just don't factually believe that. And I, I would just rather nah, just that, sit that's on- That's the biggest lie Sometimes I just sit on the ground. That, no, that is a lie. It's not. That, you sit on the ground. You just want to shit on the ground all over again. Yes. 
Why? I want to stretch my legs out. No, because that chair is godlike. And you know, it's just- it's The godlike <laughs> chairs are never open. Nah, nah. They're nah. never open. Nah, because it's like-, like you, you could be there like, like five minutes before it fucking closes and for some nah. reason, all the comfy chairs are gone. No, no, that's just factually incorrect. <laughs> That is, it, it's <laughs> that good of a chair. That's why it's, you know, it's competitive, but it's very easy to sit on. Because yeah, when it's open. I, I'm not, I, I wasn't, isn't it prompt? Was it availability? No, it's There's hard. Book. It's com hard to sit on. Chair? It's no, hard to sit easy on. to sit on. It's hard to- when you get your cheeks in it, it's comfortable It's shit. hard to sit on because there's someone in there. I wasn't there. talking about the availability of it. <laughs> I'm oh, talking we can, about we, the fucking- I interpreted how, it that way. God, okay, well, that's your fault for being on the wrong <laughs> oh wavelength, Joey, all right? It is objectively the easiest chair to sit on and you should have known I that. I don't know why Both you're you. going at me when Gaunt was way further away. Because <laughs> you said you'd rather sit on the floor. I would rather that's sit on crazy. the floor. The floor is the seat. No, always always the seat more. Also, no. I, I still like, I, I, I'm i still trying to picture what a department store chair looks like. Cause I don't- okay, like, I, literally like- you're Are you talking about like a, a bench? Yeah. I could be a bench, some of them have chairs. Like, okay. I'm like just talking fucking, about a seat. Just a fucking chair. Like you, you're in a Uniqlo. They'll have just a chair for like the old men that don't want to walk anymore while they wait for their wife. Like no, the ones no. that look like Ottomans, like those? Like, like those it, things? It, it can be that, it can be, uh, sometimes they just have normal chairs. It can be, yeah. I've never seen a normal chair. Like I've, I, I've literally seen it. That's why I thought of it. Cause I was at a department store yesterday and I saw a fucking comfy ass chair. You could sit on the corner where this old man was hogging it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So it's hard so to see. So you did not sleeping. sit on it. And you I didn't thought sit on to it. myself, man, that would be such an easy to sit on chair right now. Arguably more easy to sit on than any other chair in the world. I can't believe that this is even even close to being hard to sit on. Insane. Oh I mean, it is hard to sit on. All right. <sighs> Let can't me- uh, my friends, man. Fucking don't get me at all. <laughs>